there's a story all about how What is up guys? We are currently going to St. Augustine. But yeah, we're gonna go see some some stuff. Some spooky stuff. My hair's a mess because I just uh I showered and it's a mess. It's crazy. Uh, but yeah, so let's get into it. Alright, let's go. Alright guys, we are finally here at the hotel. Uh, and let me tell you something. This place is moist. Alright, don't don't mind the mess. Cause uh we were just eating all this. So imagine that wasn't there, you know, forget about that. But I mean, like the lamp is on point, you know, look at this big old chair. I mean, oh. I mean, come on. Also the kitchen is super nice. I mean, look at this. Look at that. I mean, the, this kitchen is nicer than the kitchen we got at home. I mean, smaller, you know, we got a small sink. But this right here, though, this right here, though, this right here, though, is fire. Oh! Oh! And then one thing I really like, I mean, this is a nice fridge right here. Kind of small, to be honest. I'm taller than it, you know, and I'm, I'm six, eight. That's why this this fridge looks small because this is what does it say right here? Uh, it says says it on here. It's like six six five six five fridge, you know. But uh, because I'm about six eight, you know. Let's go ahead and get into the 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 part that you came for. Okay, we're trying to find something that maybe we can catch on camera. Can you tell me your name? These nuts. <laughs> Tony. This oak tree is known by locals as James's tree because, according to legend, a young boy by the name of James was climbing this very tree when he lost his footing, fell, broke his neck, and died instantly. He was buried all by his lonesome on the far end of the Talamato Cemetery next to his favorite tree because no family in St. Augustine would claim poor James. He was either an orphan or unloved. As such, nowadays he is spotted as a apparition in the branches of his favorite tree or frolicking amongst the there were a couple of teenagers that thought they knew everything, as teenagers are liable to do, and they decided to set up a tent in the center of the cemetery next to that very oak tree, and they were just about to fall asleep when they heard a ruckus. The 
thinking it was just one of their friends pulling a prank on them while they set out to prove that the cemetery wasn't haunted, they ripped open their tent flaps and they looked outside and they saw a woman floating off the ground with a long white dress, long gray hair cascading down her back, and no face. I saw some, I saw what it looked like was it looked like somebody was peeping, like peeking out, and I thought it was a person. Could be a shadow person. And then when I put it, like literally, like when I put it on, I saw it go back by the, by the big house. So did you take? You got to take I, I got a video. Oh okay. Okay. Yeah. So we take double pictures. Oh picture. my gosh, man. No, okay. It's kind of dark, so. But we're currently going to the fort. We're, We're gonna try to find something. Self goals hunting. Uh, the tour we went on, I mean, the history was cool. You know, it was funny. They had some corny jokes, but it was uh, not very spooky. Uh, so we're gonna go do it ourselves, except we don't have the equipment. But it's okay, they didn't have the equipment either. I'm about right there, right? Yeah. <laughs> nah, that's more. It's more like that one, right? Goodness gracious, though, but look at how big this is, though. That's what she said. This is nice. Even if we don't find it, but this is a nice little, nice little date. Oh my gosh, bro. There we go. It just won't focus at all. And then sometimes the touch doesn't work. Oh my gosh, bro. What's good with this camera? Him. Mira. Legit, like I think, see, it, usually you're supposed to touch it and it's supposed to focus. And all day today, bro. So weird, it's literally been, I don't know, I just think the camera's broken. You sure? Very it's actually gotten worse since I got here, but I don't think it's. Did you hear that? Yeah. Yo, what is that? That's a kind. Oh, of <laughs> from here, you can't really see it on the camera. Okay, so there's definitely the sounds coming from the bars and stuff from that side. But there's something but coming. There was literally someone coughing on the other side of that wall. Yeah, of course this camera's not gonna pick it up. This right here, looking kind of, kind of creepy. <laughs> <laughs> 